There are some who believe there's a population of hellish primates living in the Appalachian Mountains known as devil monkeys. So the story goes, in 1994, a young woman was driving late at night near Roanoke, Virginia, when she was detoured onto a back road due to construction. As the woman drove through the darkness of the forest, a strange creature jumped in front of her car. It was around six feet tall, standing on its hind legs. It was covered in black fur and had a long, thin tail. Its body was like that of a man, and its face was somewhat like that of a man, but with cat-like features and long pointy ears. The woman shared her story with wildlife officials, but they believed it may be a feral dog or a wolf. Coincidentally, livestock in the area began to disappear around the same time. But this wasn't the first time that a similar creature had been seen in the area. In 1959, a couple was driving their car near Saltville when they claim an ape-like creature jumped out and attacked their car, leaving three scratch marks along the side of the vehicle from its claws. A few years later in that same community, two nurses were driving to work when they claim an ape-like beast attacked their car, ripping off the convertible soft top. Sightings of these strange primates have been reported all throughout Appalachia, New England, and even Alaska. So you tell me, is there a strange race of hybrid primates living in the Appalachian Mountains, or is it all a figment of our imagination?